clean, dry and hygienic conditions are most essential for healthy living. Waterproofing of floors in kitchens or toilets is necessary to eliminate leakage and dampness in floors and to create hygienic conditions for healthy living. For quick drainage of dirty water in kitchen or toilet floors, it is necessary to avoid leakage or dampness in these floors to eliminate unhygienic conditions. Elimination of dampness and leakage across the floor requires perfect waterproofing treatment of floors. Waterproofing treatment of kitchen or toilet floors can be carried out in many ways such as tar felt, multiplies, bituminous materials, waterproof cement concrete, etc. Tar felt is one of the very commonly used methods for waterproof treatment of floors in the kitchen. Tar felt is made from jute impregnated in asphaltic bituminous material containing certain fibrous materials. Tar felt is quite elastic and leak proof. Water or dampness cannot pass through a good quality tar felt sheet. The coal tar of required grade is heated before coating on the floor slab. The grade of bituminous use for damp roofing is 85 by 25. 85 by 25 grade bitumen refers to softening temperature of 85 degrees Celsius and average penetration value of 25. This is most suitable bitumen grade for damping proofing purposes. Treatment with tar felt provides an effective method of leak proofing kitchen or toilet floors. The floor slab to be treated is cleaned thoroughly using wire brushes to remove all dirt, dust or fungus, etc. The surface may be washed and dried before waterproof treatment. The tar felt sheets are spread on the surface of the floor slab to be treated and cut to the size. Whenever necessary, a minimum overlap of 100 millimeter to 150 millimeter is always provided during cutting of the sheets. Cutting of tar felt sheets to the size is done before applying primer and bonding coat on the prepared float slab surface. Primer coat of antifungus chemical sealant liquid is poured on the clean dry surface and spread manually with a wooden float Primer coat of antifungus chemical sealant liquid is laid to fill the cracks, holes 
and crevices in the dried floor slab. This primer coat seals all passages through the floor slab. A further primer coat of low viscosity bituminous liquid may also be applied on the chemically treated floor surface. A base bonding coat of hot bituminous liquid of grade 85 by 25 is applied on the primer coated slab surface at the rate of 1.65 kilogram per square meter. The measured and cut sheets of tar felt are laid on the prepared surface with base bonding coat of hot bituminous liquid. These star felt sheets are laid according to the contour and slope of the floor slab necessary and pressed for sticking without any air bubble underneath. Whenever necessary, a minimum overlap of 100 millimeter shall be provided along the joints of tar felt sheets. The late tar felt sheets are further coated with hot bitumen to receive next layer of tar filled sheets for perfect damp proofing. Normally, single layer of tar felt is used for economic reasons. This coat of bitumen seals any passage in joints of tar felt. The joints, if any in two layers of tar felt, should always be staggered. Second layer of tar felt is also coated with hot bituminous liquid to seal any cracks or crevices or joints. This finely coated surface is ready to receive filling materials. Lightweight filling materials such as cinder, brick ballast, etc., is placed over the second layer of tar felt and laid to create appropriate slope in the finished surface. Lay final flooring surface over properly laid and finished layer of filler material. Properly laid tafel treatment can provide lifelong service without any leakage or dampness.